Frankie Zapata's personal flying machine, Air Scooter, is equipped with two joysticks on board that resemble the ones used for VR gaming and that control the VTOL, giving the pilot the sensation of being in a jet fighter video game. Zapata, the company that also introduced Flyboard Air and Jet Racer, unveiled Air Scooter in June 2025 during the Viva Technology event, where attendees had the opportunity to see the live model of the personal flying machine. Looking at the design, Air Scooter features six rotors extending from its body, forming a pinwheel style. This design is intended to facilitate easy vertical takeoff and landing VTOL. Each rotor is equipped with twin sharp blades, and they are not enclosed so caution must be observed. Zapata indicates that the personal flying machine and VTOL would be powered by a hybrid electric propulsion system that could provide a longer flight time than any other VTOL in the market, as stated by Zapata. Top speed at 100 km per hour with cruise speed of 80 km per hour. The VTOL air scooter by Zapata is generous in giving the pilot scenic views from the inside. Its egg-shaped body makes it easy for the design team to opt for panoramic glass around the front part of the personal flying machine. It might entail that looking up, down, and sideways from the VTOL may feel as if the pilot were soaring high without barriers. Inside Air Scooter, the cushioned seat has safety belts, and as soon as the pilot sits down, they can navigate the personal aircraft using the console-like joysticks in front of them. While the full specs are yet to be disclosed, Zapata shares that the VTOL Air Scooter could have a flight time of up to almost two hours. Its potential top speed is at 100 km per hour with a cruise speed of 80 km per hour. The maximum payload is at 120 kilos, and since it is hybrid electric, the petrol tank can carry up to 18.9 liters. The personal flying machine, whose mass market release may still be up in the air, is dubbed compliant with the Federal Aviation Authority regulations and can be flown without a pilot's license in the U.S. as an ultralight aircraft. For the latest information, stay tuned for Mitamoto. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so we can continue to develop this channel together. Thank you. See you next time.